running this new Suzuki uh, 9.9 .9 horse. I just did the first uh, service on it. The motor, ha I hooked my computer up to it. The motor has 17 hours and 42 minutes on it right now. Um, it's gonna do the first fluid change and filter change at 20 hours. Uh, new motor oil, new oil filter, uh, new gear oil, and new uh, O-ring gaskets for the um, filter and stuff. I also put the date on the uh, oil filter housing down in there. Um, I hooked up my vessel view thing to the Mercury 60 horse and he only has 4.4 hours on that one so we're gonna hold off to do the first fluid and filter change on the Mercury um, because he has such low hours on it. He puts more time on the kicker motor than the main motor. Like most people they use their main motor to get where they're going and then their kicker motor once they're out there. Um, this kicker is good to go for a hundred hours now um, so the next time he brings it in for the, the fluids and filters it should have around 120 hours on it you know, like I said he's still got some time left to go on the main motor before it's time for that great little motors this one's a lot simpler than a lot of the other uh, Suzuki's that come to me because this one's manual tilt and full start, uh, no electric start, no hydraulic tilt trim, and all the other wiring and crap that goes along with it. So I like simple, <laughs> less things that go wrong with simple. It has a uh, rev limiter on it, so it only lets you go a certain amount of throttle and neutral. And that's what it does. It's the rev limiter kept kicking in. Reverse. Neutral. Neutral. Yeah, this motor's good to go for a hundred hours. The main motor, he needs more hours on it before the first uh, fluid change, and then he'll be good for a hundred hours after that. But uh, both motors are golden, though.